This show, again, it was R5 and Jacob, Whitesides, and Ryland, and this time, I don't know if it was the day before or two days before or something like that, um, I had obviously seen Jacob for the first time live and I was like, I knew I was going the second date and I was like, oh, why can't I just like go get um, VIP for him? So I did, like a last minute decision. I, I just bought his VIP package. Honestly, had only listened to his songs the night before live and didn't really know anything about him at all. <laughs> but I did it anyways. Um, I got to the venue and I parked in a parking garage and it was really hard and I was honestly scared that they were gonna give me a ticket because I wasn't sure if I was actually supposed to be in there. And then I walked around this neighborhood for like, it was at least two to three miles. Um, at one point, there's these people like on their porch who started screaming at me and being, and was like, Yo, the stupid white girl in this neighborhood, she doesn't get it. And I was like, I'm the stupid white girl. <laughs> um, yeah, that's that's true. But also I was lost and couldn't find the venue again because <laughs> I had walked so much and it was like raining. Like it was going back and forth between like pouring down rain and being super sunny. And like, I didn't have an umbrella. I didn't have anything. So, you know, that's how that worked out. <laughs> It was fun. And then, you know, I went to the Jacob meet and greet and I got into like the line and met him and everything. And the, one of the first things he said to me was like, hi, have we met before? And I was like, no. And he's like, are you sure? And I was like, that's a dumb question. <laughs> Wouldn't I know if we've met before? I, I think I would know more than you would, but I, obviously I didn't say that, but I really wanted to because like, that's kind of a dumb question. People ask me that a lot. They're like, have we met before? And I'm like, I've already said no. So like, why wouldn't I, t why, why would I lie to you? <laughs> and then, you know, I just went to the show. And during the show, we were like, all of Jacob's fans got seats like 10 rows or 15 rows back. It was something like that. I think it was 10 rows back. So we were all in like these two rows <laughs> at the end of this section and noticing that the nine rows ahead of us were mostly empty. <laughs> All of the R5 VIP people it was mostly empty. Um, that was fun. None of these people knew I was an R5 fan at the time. Um, they all thought that I was just a Jacob fan, so they were like talking to me and they're like, yeah, I've never actually really listened to R5, like I'm just kind of here for Jacob and blah 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 blah, and I was like, yeah, same, um, as this was like you know, my 7th or 8th R5 show at this point. <laughs> I was totally just going along with it. Um, but let me say, those Jacob fans were so much fun. And low-key, they were more fun than the fans that I was used to going to R5 shows with, like, or being around. And maybe it's just because I'm always in the front that, like, I don't know, maybe people in the front just don't have as much fun. I don't know. I don't think that could might be it. I don't know. Just because it was so much fun. Like, all of Jacob's fans just like went crazy and they did not care. And it was so funny. There was a little girl that had met R5 in the row above us and like, they were so scared. <laughs> we tried to like talk to her and like get her to like speak to us and stuff like that. And their moms were great. But as soon as the concert started, she like freaked out. She did not like, she did not want to stand up. She did not want to do anything. She didn't want to dance. She didn't want to do it. She kept covering her ears and I felt so bad. Um, but that's what happened. It was insane. Like, I've never had so much fun in an R5 show in my life. I think. Maybe. I don't know. That's one of the best, at least. And I was masquerading as somebody else's fan and not theirs, so what does that say about me? <laughs> She's got snake and cigarettes Cross the line of sail on the ocean oh, And she's not my type at all Falls out in a weird t-shirt on Life is too loud and a bit too long And I think she's not my type at all But she's got
show um a lot of the jacob fans left early because they wanted to catch him on the tour bus i waited until the end of the show but then i caught up with them afterwards and we were just like standing by the tour buses which again i had never done that before with r5 or like ever i don't know it was never something that i was really interested in but they made it so much fun like the people that i was around for that made it so much fun to do and i'm just i'm really glad i went to that show I don't, I don't know what else to say. Um, my name's Kristen. Thanks for watching. I'll see you soon. That's a promise. Bye.